Right now, there's a national effort to find a treatment for one of the most aggressive forms of breast cancer, one affecting primarily African-American women. CBS 42 News reporter Britt Moore live in Birmingham with how UAB is spearheading those efforts. Britt. Well, our, yeah, the National Institute of Health recently launched the largest ever study looking at the relationship between genetics and breast cancer and black women. Also recently, some other studies have showed that black women are more likely to die from their diseases, also more likely to be diagnosed with aggressive forms of breast cancer, like triple negative breast cancer, which is why UAB uh, researchers are kind of ahead of the game here. They're trying to find ways to treat this specific type of cancer, that's triple negative breast cancer, with the help of clinical trials. Now, women like Eva Carter, who you heard from last half hour, are surviving now. Oncologists say about 40% of women diagnosed with triple negative breast cancer, most often black women don't respond to typical chemotherapy. Very good number of patients can be cured with standard chemotherapy, but there's still a group of patients that cannot, in which we need to find better drugs. And the only way to find better drugs is to do clinical trials. Now, he says more research needs to be done, but cancer patients also have to be open to clinical trials that are available to them in order to help women in the future. Now, coming up in the next half hour, getting that diagnosis, triple negative breast cancer can be daunting. Why people are just pouring into a support group here at UAB from all over the country. For now, we're live in Birmingham. Britt Moore, CBS 42 News.